Ruth here, and it has finally arrived. The Wizarding World Crate from Moot Crate. <clears throat> and I actually looked on the website, it does say between the 15th and the 25th of that month. This is obviously the September box. So, yeah. And it's the 9th of October today. So, yeah, it's a bit late, though. I'm guessing, if I'm right, came from. Actually, where did it come from? Her wants worth. What? So, I don't know. It's late for me, anyway. I don't know if it's late for anybody else, but anyway. Okay, so let's move. Okay, so as you see, I already took the sticker off. Didn't look, at, didn't open this yet, but since I do keep the stickers, so I don't want to, you know, ruin them or nothing. I'll uh, put a picture at the end anyway, and I know you put like the image of a sticker inside. I mean, on the uh, thumbnail thing. So let's look what it is, and as you see, it is pretty rectangle. So sweet. Wow. Oh. Oh, well, look at that. Let's just move the camera a bit so you can see. Look at that. That's the ceiling of the Great Hall. That is very nice. Okay. Let's... Let me pull her through so that I can find the uh, piece of paper. Okay. So, what is this? Oh, back to Hogwarts. For some reason, I totally forgot the theme, for whatever reason. So that is a very nice backdrop, though. Good for if people are, like, interested in doing those, you know, take those pictures on Instagram and stuff. <clears throat> so, back to Hogwarts. It's time for another magical school year. Prepare yourself. For the adventures ahead with these back to school essentials inspired by going back to Hogwarts. Okay, so let's see what we got. And let's just do a small thing first. Hang on. Uh, we got another apologies thing. We are so excited for you to unbox our back to Hogwarts crate. We just wanted to let you know that one of your items needs a little more time to arrive. Look forward to receiving your Hedwig pin. Ooh. Hedwig pin. Man. Uh, in a separate shipment by mid-October, so which will probably be November for me. Um, please accept our humble apologies for this inconvenience. If you have any questions or concerns, our friendly customer support team at Loot.crs forward slash help will be happy to assist you. Sincerely, Team Loot Crate. Yeah. So that's a bummer. But anyway. There, I found my soul. While I have it zoomed, you can see that sticker better. I was really looking forward to the pin. I guess I might as well read it. A headring pin. Given to Harry on his 11th birthday by Hagrid, Hedwig is Harry's beloved snow owl and the first creature in our new Magical Creature Series Pin Series. New Magical Creatures Pin Series. I think I almost said series twice, didn't I? Anyway, that's nice. From like a little picture. Looks like Hedwig carrying a letter. I'm guessing it might be the acceptance letter. I don't know. Well, I guess it's symbolic. Because technically, Henry didn't actually carry that, because obviously Harry got that after. So let's see, what's this? Ooh, sweet. Approach with extreme caution. Uh, it, by the looks of it, it's a bookmark, maybe? And contact the ministry if you have any information. Very cool uh, packaging, anyway. So obviously this back is like 
part of the Daily Prophet, I guess. Or something like that. That's what it's designed for, anyway. So what is this? Yes, it is the Hogwarts House bookmark. Get lost in a book without losing your place. Get this die-cut metal bookmark featuring your house, crest, and colored tassel. Or hang it up as a decoration. That is cool. I definitely use that. I do have quite a few books I read. Um, Okay, do I want to open it? Because it looks like it will take ages to open. I mean, to put back. Mm. Okay, I'm going to show you the picture because I don't really have the space to open it right now. So, let me just... Okay, here it is. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Ambition, pride, and cunning. That is the Hogwarts house banner. Show off your house pride and your most admirable traits by unfurling this delightful house mascot banner. By the way, all of it is the Loot Crate exclusive. That's cool, though I have nowhere to put it. I'm like, we don't really stick things on the wall in this house anyway. I don't know, nails. Anyway. So, next thing. Ooh. That's nice. I had no idea what to do with it though. I mean, it's so pretty. And since it is a little exclusive, I wouldn't want to use it. Oh. Awesome. So this... Like that. So Hogwarts House Notebook. Obviously so long. Should know that by now. <laughs> it's like the eleventh box or something. Anyway, when parchment just won't do, jot down your latest spells in this notebook, showcasing your house crest and colors. Awesome. I really wouldn't want to use it. I mean, so hmm. I mean, like if I had another one, like a double one for, to like for display or collection thing, and the other one to actually do stuff in. But I wouldn't want to ruin it, you know. That's the problem with stationary things, is once you use them, you can't really, you know, unuse it. Unless it was like a whiteboard, then you can obviously rub it out. But that is so cool. Okay, the last item. Though, to be honest, this is very cool. I mean, just look at that. It's awesome. Back to what I was saying. Noisy sisters are not in the area. Okay, so as I was saying, Hogwarts House book bag. Carry all your wizarding supplies in style. In this bewitching book bag, ascent, accented, you know that, by your house colors and a screen printed house pat, house patch. Yes, that's cool. No, to be honest, the other ones are do look cool as well. I said briefly, sure do. I mean, they do look cool. 
Okay. Let's see what we have. I think most of these stuff's made by BioWorld. And as always, all things are made in China these days. Alright. So, you see, it is very cool. Now, obviously, this shoulder strap bit. This got a front pocket. See? I guess you could put your phone in that. Or stuff. Okay, it's got this here. You got a buckle. You know, like kind of like a purse, but this is more the yeah, fold it. So, yeah. 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 Okay. this is more like this, yes. Very clear. Like no pockets on the inside. Okay. So basically, this, this type of bag just, yeah, fold it. Then you clip it into place. Okay. So, I'm not a too, too sophisticated type of bag. So, like these, obviously, for design. Not really scratchy, but so it's gonna fit a few things in this. Obviously, it's a book bag, so I mean, it's for books, I guess. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Obviously, it's fit on your shoulder for forever because it is a book bag. Yeah. Very cool. I like the back, actually. So, other after that, we are only missing the head of the pin. And I'm not going to do it any closer because I don't want to spoil it when I actually do a little video of it. Whether I'll just tack it on to the end of like a shout out video or on the end of something, I don't know, because it'd be a very, very short video if I just do it on the pin. But yes, that is everything. The black and red do go really good together. The black and green is good as well. But anyway, so yes, that is everything that came. Right? But, <clears throat> yes. So I'm just stuck down for the go, so that is this one. Back downwards. So I shall tell you what as um what's the next one I guess. So let me just Put this in here for now. Yeah. I'm not really sure. But obviously, I don't go to school anymore. So what would I use this for? I guess I could use it for when I go shopping. Not that I can put much in it when I go shopping. 
but I can obviously put the bag. Here's really what in it. Yeah. But anyway, just one second. Okay. Okay, the next thing is, um, Actually, how many stuff was that? One, two, three, four, and the pin is five. So yeah, that's, that's, they changed it from five to seven to, and they changed it to five, from five to seven to what, four to five, from three to five. So they kind of went down a number, unfortunately. So, by the uh, looks of it, Next week's um, theme, yes, that's the word. Next week's theme is Legends and Lore. Um, yeah, I need to buy it before the 3rd of November at 9 p.m. Uh, Pacific time. I guess that's a PT, isn't it? Supplies are limited. Literally, it says. Supplies are limited on there. Okay. So, basic thing. You choose your plan, which is one crate, three crates, or six crates, because it comes every other month. And you pay every other month. You select a house. You select a shirt size, which there wasn't a shirt in here. Actually, it just occurred to me there wasn't a shirt. Hmm. Not that I'm complaining though. Then obviously it will be for, well for me, because I'm in the UK, it is £39. Though for some reason in the last one I paid £40.10. I don't know why. Okay, um. Let's see. Oh! They changed it again to four to six magical items in each crate. Exclusive and officially licensed Harry Potter and Fantastic Beasts gear. Wizard wizarding gear to show off for Hogwarts House Pride and more. 65 plus dollars MSRP value in every box. Crate. as I did say every other month so basically it's January, March, May, July, September, November so I'm guessing the November one or the January one will be Christmas date and it says crates arrive between 15th and 25th which today is the 9th of October so mine's pretty out there cancelling easy, no phone calls required, friendly customer service, like that. Though on their delivery of it, they like, you know, make it a bit more magical. Skip the trip to Diagon Alley. Crates get delivered right to your door. What you get is a surprise until you open it, which is kind of obvious. It's like getting an awesome birthday present from a friend every two months. So mine is like every two and a bit. <laughs> anyway, next one should be fun because Legends of Lore, let's see, the little blurb on the thing. I actually didn't read it yet, did I? Okay. The legends are true. Explore the magical and enchanting history of the wizarding world as we create the dark legends, revered icons, and mystical artifacts that make up its very foundation. So basically the Deathly Hollows is what I'm thinking, because I mean, it's got I love a good holding the Deathly Hollow symbol necklace thing. Okay, so yes, that is it. Uh, there is a link below that is the, uh, what's it, referral link? 
click that, you get, what is it, five dollars off your first crate or something? I don't know. You get something off? No, was it three? Anyway, you get, you get some money off your crate if you use that. Um, was there anything else? I don't think so. So, look forward to, um, the next one. It's in another two thing. It's in November, isn't it? Yes. November slash December for me. So yes, so thank you for watching. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Which one is your favorite? Because, like, I don't know. I quite like the Pokemon. That's pretty nice. It's a nice heavy duty metal, too. Well, not as heavy, but it's nice that it's a metal one, not plastic or anything. The acrylic would have worked fine, too. I like the tassel as well. Anyway, the bag's useful. The banner is more for aesthetically pleasing than actual usefulness. Bookmark is useful. Notebook is useful if I actually, actually ever use it. Because, like, I don't want to mess it up or nothing. Oops. And the uh, art on the back of the box is real pretty. I like it. So, mystical. Magical. Yes, anyway. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more. Ring that doorbell. Over now.